this is the continuation to Oh My God, number three. I actually made like a eight minute video and I had to stop it because I mentioned a name. <laughs> and, you know, I have to protect all of my characters. Like, pretend they're not a narcissist. Um, yeah. So I saw this uh, video and I brought up. Okay, at the. The, oh my god, number two video, this is a continuation, oh my god, number three video. So, I was saying about progression. It's progression to ask. Like, late Theodore... Late George Carl... <laughs> Carl... <laughs> Jake... Late George Carlin. Jake, late George Carlin, who was an atheist... He will not burn in hell forever. Because he was a beautiful atheist. And this is one of the most beautiful truths that came out of his comedy truth. Ten commandments. You can just, you know, just cut them down. And two. Now he doesn't believe in my God now. Uh, and why, um. There's so much wrong with Christianity. God just chose... Did God even choose his own? God is whoever God is. Okay, and, um... You live in hell. So let's just say hell, it was always hell. Maybe there was no God in a heavenly place and uh, his angels worshipping him 24-7. Maybe that was just a story. Or it was a story that was lessened, and we don't know the whole story. Well, then I don't want to know any of the story. I don't want to know any of the Adam and Eve story or the Noah's Ark story, because it doesn't make any sense. And Hell Earth certainly doesn't make any sense with the Mayans of their, um, the damn alien Mayans. Whoever, you know, whatever, the Aztecs, the Mayan... And Egyptians, whatever went on in the world, whatever the evil alien demons are, Satan, yeah, like Satan's all around. Like, you know, is there a God? Yeah, there are a few good people. Doug and Stacy off the grid, the Max, they are farmers on YouTube. They are awesome YouTubers. And... I don't understand why the majority of people are not like the Max and Doug and not Stacy. Or anybody else. I don't know why. I, I mean, people get all kinds of help. And then you have people who have no help at all. Like the people over in Israel. Or the people in Sudan. No, more like the people in Sudan. Some of those people in Israel, uh, the children looked okay. Uh, I mean, like, shit. Even though after, you know, they were hit, maybe a kid has blood on his arm, but still, like, the, the, um, it wasn't like, they were wearing paper bags or something. Um, they're, they had adequate clothing. They, uh, but I, I mean, yeah. They're kicked out of their house, and they don't have anything now. It's just because monsters decide to come in and take over at the whole place, which is wrong. And it doesn't make any sense. And then, you know, uh, my son, who's an atheist, even made fun of, oh, yeah, well, oh, is, yeah, whatever's going on over there. Yeah, what is going on over there? Yeah, is that where Jesus originated? <laughs> um... He's born in Bethlehem. I should actually read and uh, do research. And uh, so, George Carlin, genius atheist, who uh, told the truth by being a comedian and got a lot more truth out. 
more truth out more than you know. And should be congratulated and he should have been more than a millionaire. I would imagine that he was a millionaire, but I mean, he should have had more. He should have got paid more than what he was given. I, I don't even know. I, I, I don't... I was way too nice of a person uh, above and beyond. And then I was totally, totally stolen from and taken it. Totally, you would, I would appropriately put it, taken advantage of, stolen from, you say. Taken advantage of, of course, that's being stolen from. Um, taken advantage of sounds a little better than stolen. Uh, but both are it's all the same thieves uh it's uh that's all this planet does steal kill and destroy steal kill and destroy steal kill and destroy and why all these kids that are were sex trafficked over eighty five thousand children that can't be they don't know i mean that that's just what they recorded they don't know what happened to them So, um, it, it, it's disgusting. I'm disgusted. I'm totally disgusted in this world. God, now I, I lost commerce. Um, yeah, I should actually, you know, be professional when I do my damn videos like other professional. I mean... Yeah, I should pray every day and have a good attitude and um, forget all the haters in my life. Like, the woman that decided to calculate an, evilly, an evil calculation to deliberately steal $60 from me. That's evil. I mean, you don't go up to a person a month ago. I'll pay you back. I need six. I really, 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 really need the 60 I'll pay you back. I'll pay you back. You do not harass someone. And that's harassment. Yeah, nothing's done to her. Well, you're a dumb shit for, uh, you yeah. know. Giving it to her, okay. So, anyway, um, I don't know why some reports are listened to and others are completely, totally ignored. Usually victims are completely, totally ignored. But, um, all these insane abusers have money. So that does something. That, that, that protects them with whoever is in charge and they got lawyers or they got somebody to back them up well if you're someone like me you never had anyone to back them up I will say something of course I will I'm a Jesus person I had the best backup of all time my Lord Jesus' blood, who is God, who does conquer the wickedness in heavenly realms, which is the armor of God. Now I just, there's all these millions of videos, so I don't know where I heard this from. Okay, there's like three heavens. Okay, that just sounds complicated just right there at the get-go. Okay, so we started off in hell. So that's where I, who knows how the hell we started. Nobody knows, so you're in hell. Okay. And it's very interesting that it says God's, the armor of God, who is Jesus' blood, conquers the wickedness in heavenly realms found in Ephesians 6.10. So, the second heaven. Oh, um, this was when, this is possibly Stephen Barkar's, Ban Carr's uh, testimony of when he used to be a uh, new Asia. He went into trans... Trans... Uh, he left his body with a... Uh, trans... Astrological... Uh, ascending... Trans... I don't know what the word is. Okay, but the... The, the travel... Uh, to leave your body... And when he left his body, he was going, uh, somebody communicated this to him, so he, this came from somewhere, uh, communi some communication to him, or it was him himself, and that was, when they went to the second heaven, they found a demon, 
there was a, a Hindu demon Shiva or Dali or what whatever the hell D Dala. It was a Mind Valley guy or it, like people go to the same place like like you live in hell and the heavenly places wickedness is in the heavenly places ah you go to the second level of heaven and there's a demon so fuck is there a real god and does he have all this power to destroy the heavenly realms 